torrent. There's a huge trout right here. Yeah. Here's the story of how I caught my first ever tiger trout. It's October in Alberta and we've yet to have our first huge snowfall. The colors during this time are incredible and what most postcards are made of. So Josh calls me up with confirmation that a alpine lake has been stocked with tiger trout, something neither of us have landed before. Now we have fished this alpine lake before, knowing that it did take a short but very steep hike to get to where we need to. After a debate, we decided it would be worth taking the watermasters and hiking it up there to get to this lake. Now the drive out to the base was picturesque as most leaves on the trees had yet to fall. Now there is a short gravel drive off the main highway that gives you an idea of what the Alberta foothills are really about. Editing this now, I'm in awe of some of these drone shots. What's up guys and welcome back to another video. My name is Torin and today we are out in the mountains and we have a challenge. We are trying to catch some tiger trout in the fall here, but the only problem is, is we have to hike uphill with our water master. So it should be quite interesting. Hopefully it will pay off for us with Josh today and Piper. So let's get to the hiking. I don't have a ton of footage of the hike up the mountain as I was just trying to survive, but with 80 pounds of gear on the front and back, it was a very intense hike up a mountain. It wasn't necessarily about the length, but the incredible incline to carry up that much gear. Now there are a few spots to enter and fish this lake, if not for boats, but it's incredibly more efficient in getting around the water body when we had our water masters. Now we are met with a few other anglers. Now there are still plenty of room for everyone to fish. All right, that was the hike from hell. It was absolutely terrible going up that hill, but we have pumped ourselves up and we're now dropping in to the lake. A little bit of wind, but if we get on the inside here, it's quite calm. Piper's on the back of the boat, ready to try to catch some fish. Josh is out there. We've seen a couple rise, but uh, hopefully we can get into a couple. Now, after fishing the south side of the lake for about an hour and trying various techniques and fly choices, we could see the more action was taking place near the other belly boaters. Now, as they drifted away from the other end, we began paddling over to the north side of the lake. This was a great decision as we started to visually see cruising fish. Torrent. There's a huge trout right here. Now, of course, the biggest problem was trying to find what they wanted to eat because we were both nymphing at about 10 to 14 feet with no luck switching up some of the flies we had been using. But once we started to see cruising fish, it was quite evident that there were issues with our tactics. Without movement in the fly, they had too much time to decide it wasn't for them. So we did decide to switch it up and add a ton of movement or action to the fly. Now adjusting accordingly, we added small leeches and boatman patterns. Oh, they're chasing it. They were chasing it right in front of me. Now I hooked up a couple times before landing my first fish. Nothing like the anxiousness of losing two fish you've never landed before, hoping you will meet one more chance. Now this fish wasn't anything to write home about other than crossing it off my species list, but nonetheless, I was stoked. Ah, first tiger. Now Josh had a very similar experience and caught the fish of the day for sure. The way the fish was covered up was impressive to see. Yeah. Now 
Now the wind picked up and the sun started to hide behind some ominous looking clouds. After a short paddle back, we packed our gear and headed down the mountain. This was incredibly easier than the way up and took approximately 15 minutes to get down. We hit the dusty road home and started editing the footage to share my first tiger trout ever. I hope you guys enjoyed it and until next time, tight lines.